Hey, what's going on everybody? This is your boy Reminders and I'm back again with another video. And in today's video, I'll be taking y'all along with a leg day. Um, I know last time in the last video, I showed y'all little clips, but this time I actually showed y'all a full leg day. So yeah, Paulina was with me. So we um, we did us a leg day, um, my typical leg day. Um, we didn't deadlift. We started to deadlift, but I, my back was killing me because we had just trained back the day before. So I couldn't, um, I couldn't really deadlift. I was in too much pain. My back was so sore. So even when I bend down, it was sore. And I also um, I got my new belt, um, the extra large. They finally shipped it. It came in that day, so I tried it out. And I don't know how y'all use the belts like that, man. It's something I got to get used to. But um, let's go ahead and get into it, man. All right, man. So here we go. Here I'm up here just stretching, trying to um, get my body warmed up, get my legs open, my hips open. Um, <clears throat> stretching my legs out and this right here i don't know what these right here are called but it opens up my hips big time because i used to have a hard time doing um, squats i guess because i wasn't doing that my hips wasn't as um flexible and open but um <clears throat> yeah we warming up with just the bar right now trying to make sure everything is good um get everything warm up we still warming up so we get <clears throat> 135 on the on the um bar and we hitting that for 10. That's just a, we're warming up once again, getting everything, getting blood flowing. And then next thing we jump from that to 225. I used to go like to like one um 135, 185, stuff like that, but I was like, it's no point. <clears throat> so I was like, let me just go ahead and start getting jumping straight to 225, save some of my energy, and you know, start knocking those out. That way I can have more energy to do the 315. And like today on this day, I hit 335. <clears throat> I'm sorry, y'all. I have I was over here choking on some um some water, and um it's like still stuck in my throat. But <clears throat> yeah, so I'm hitting the 225. Um, it's still a warm up because I'm working my way up to 335. Like I said today, I played around with 335, and I haven't lifted 335, so this would be my new PR. Um, so we working our way up, <clears throat> taking some time to get there. And I think after 25, I jumped to 275. Yeah, 275. And that's when it was time to bring out the belt. As I told you earlier, I bought the belt. As you can see, I'm sitting there adjusting the belt, trying to figure out where I want the belt placement. Because <clears throat> I never wore a belt before. It's my first time ever wearing a, um, a weightlifting belt. And I've seen online, I heard that it's supposed to be around your belly button. As you see, I'm still adjusting and trying to get it right. So I'll go for my attempt for the 275. <clears throat> I need to work on my walkouts. Like my walkouts are horrible right now, to be honest with you. I need to work on those. Like it looks so bad. I really need to work on those. Um, so I'm hitting the 275. I think I hit that for like five or maybe seven. I think it was seven. See my calves flexing. Like, like I feel like my form is pretty well. Um, I feel like I didn't really lose my form until I got to the 335, especially with the belt. The first, y'all see. So we had 315 now. <clears throat> Trying to get my mind right, because that's some heavy ass weight, to be honest with y'all. You see, y'all see this dude in the background? The dude, this dude right here, um, was going crazy. He had like four 45s on each side with a 35. I think that's what I think it was his max. But he was only doing one rep. So uh, I don't know if y'all really count. He's, he's doing PR maxes, I guess you could say. So I'm hitting my 335. I wonder what Paulina thinking. She's sitting there just lost and we're like, like, she just be lost. Look at she's scratching her head. She just be lost. But yeah, man, I'm hitting my 335. Um, not 335, I think it's 315. Um, it's moving a little bit more. If y'all seen the clip in the last couple videos or the shorts, um, it was moving, but it wasn't moving as fast as it is now. It's getting, I'm getting stronger and stronger and more comfortable with the 300s. So um, I wanted to throw her in there. So she had her, her 225. So she hit 245 because she had 225. And then she uh put the tens on each side. This is her PR. Um, the most that she's done. I guess she seen me hit the, the 315, and she was like, she wanted the uh what's cause I cause I told her I was like, I'm gonna go for a three uh 335 today. So and she's so she's too short for her to put the thing back. So I had to help her put it back. So as y'all see. <clears throat> 335 of them putting the belt on 
we get in there. And as y'all, I don't know if y'all are a belt expert, but you, the belt looks like it's kind of high on me. Um, and like I said, I'm, this is my first time wearing a belt, so I don't know how to put a belt on properly. But I put the belt on. I think my walkout. My walkout is horrible. I think I've been working on it because like today, today was leg day as well. And I did the, um, I put both of my legs together closer um, before when I picked it up and I was able to walk out better because whenever I walk out, sometimes the weights hit the little metal bars. But after that first squat, I felt that belt dig into my ribs. I was like, ah, sheesh. And I, as y'all can see, I was thinking about putting it back. But you see, I hit another one and I'm like, nah, man, let me put this back because it's heavy. I can feel it's heavy and it's hurting. So that's the first thing I do. I go to adjust the belt and Paulina think I'm done. She like, okay, he done, whatever, you know. But now nah, I'm like, nah, I got, I got, I got at least hit five. Can't hit two. Can't hit one. Like, come on, man, I got hit five. So I go back up under that thing. Got to get your mind right. I'm sitting. I'm like, ah. So we get back. Uh, look at that step back. I struggle back. Like I said, I'm working on that. We getting better. So we, uh, no, no knee, no knee straps, no knee straps, no knee braces, none of that. Raw dog, and I got a belt on. First time wearing a belt. But yeah, that was that was my third one. Ah, that's my fourth one. In my mind, I'm like, bro, this is heavy. Then I hit my fifth one. And then, you know, we put it right on back. That's 335, man. Um, and next, we move on to deadlifts. Um, I just look at look, I'm exhausted. So we move on to deadlifts. Got 225. Um, I didn't really go into depth with these deadlifts because, like I said, we trained back yesterday. So it was hurting for me to even bend over just to pick it up. So I hit it twice. And I was like, ah, start wiping my hands. I ain't had no chalk. It's like, there's no point putting on chalk. It's 225. So that's my third one. And then I was like, uh, yeah, I'm done with this. My back is killing me. So we go on to the leg curls, um, which was towards the, we did a warm up set and then four sets of 12 of the um, leg curls. So, you know, <clears throat> not going too crazy with it, just getting the, um, the, the movement going. And things like that. So, you know, I can't complain with that. Um, <clears throat> then, once we finished that, I went on to the, um, we went on to the leg extensions. Well, like I said, we did a warm-up set and then four sets of 12 to get, um, to close out. And that was, the, that was the leg day for this day. You know, <clears throat> as you see, I'm bracing myself, hitting it. Um, I didn't go too crazy, as you see. I didn't pull no full stack or nothing like that. So, hey, you know. Hey man, so that's the conclusion of the video, man. Um, that was a, a typical, pretty much typical leg day. Only thing that I really missed out was the deadlifts. Really didn't do the deadlifts, but normally, typically, we do a deadlift as well. Um, today was on a coincidence. Today was actually a leg day, but today we did squat, deadlift, leg press, calf raises, and um, this glute machine, which I really liked. Um, I felt like it really engaged my glutes. So, shout out to Paulina. She the one that found it. So she found that machine. So we um decided to use that machine. So it was pretty cool. Um, today was a good day, man. Um, I hope y'all liked the video. Um, like I said, I'll be bringing y'all more content. Um, I'm not. I'm. I don't know if 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 y'all like it, then I'll record more while we working out. Um, but I know I have to give y'all a um, arms day, back day, stuff like that. Cause I haven't did those, but it looks like my recording days will be Sunday. That right there was in the middle of the week. I was just anxious to record. I was excited because I had got my camera like the day before and my memory card and my uh, wide lens didn't come in until the following day. So that was just something that I wanted to do. So it came in, memory card came in like right, right before I left for the gym as I was changing, like right before I changed, right before I got home and I was changing my clothes, memory card came on in. And um, I popped it in and then went straight to town, went straight to uh, the gym and, and recorded for y'all. So that's it. Just to let y'all know how bad I want to want to be able to show y'all these things, man. Bring y'all with this journey with us, man. Go ahead and close out this video. Um, I'm going I'm to finish editing it. This is the outro that I'm recording now. And then I'm going to um, probably get it rendered for YouTube. And then um, see how my stomach and everything's feeling. Because I just drunk this detox tea, which... I don't have it on me right now. It's in, I put it in the kitchen and excuse my bed and stuff, man. Like today's been a rough day for me. Worked out. After workout, I went to go get my groceries. 
um I actually have my food right here. Actually, um seven ounces of chicken breast, which is almost gone. I've been eating that. Um, two ounces of whole grain pasta and broccoli with some hot sauce and some zero uh sugar. Um I think it's called I can't think of the name of it right now, but barbecue sauce. Whoa, I could feel my quad. Yo, I feel my quads growing real time. I feel the heartbeat in them, bro. Yo, this is crazy. 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 I feel them moving. I might be tripping. But um, yeah, like I was saying, you got the ballerina tea. Um, it's like a it's a detoxing tea, I guess you could say. I wanted to I've been saying I, I've been I used to do it back then. Um, to clean out, keep my stomach, uh, my gut healthy on the regular. Sometimes not on the regular, but whenever I felt like I needed that cleansing, I would do it. And I felt like I've been needing that cleansing for a while now, um, just to flush everything out. My stomach hasn't been giving me no issues or nothing like that. But um, I did have some GMOs recently for the first time in a long time, and I woke up feeling like I didn't feel right. Um, so I didn't feel right till after I uh, went to the gym and, and burnt it off. Um, so that's when I started to feel better. Yeah, my stomach right now is is waiting, waiting for it to to erupt, waiting for it to activate. I guess you could say, but it hasn't activated yet. But I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting. So I'm trying to get this video out to y'all as soon as possible. I hope y'all like it. Um, if you're a new person here, I hope you subscribe. If you're a returning person, I want to shout you out because I really appreciate it. And um, if you know anybody that that you think that would be entertained by this um by my content, um. Let them know. Um, like I said, man, we I'm trying to build a close knit group on here. Um, bunch of bunch of men that just just want to do better, want to grow. Um, that's not into the the social norm. So if that's for you, or if you know somebody that that's them, let them know. Bring them all over this way, man. Um, but yeah, man, I appreciate y'all for watching and tuning in. And if you're a returning person, thank you for giving me your time. See y'all.